GNI makes pedals in Brazil. It's an old company, 60, 50 years old. We've been making pedals for six years only. So pedals are brand new for us, but they are already played by some of the greatest musicians like Andy Timmons. We have uh, good boutique stuff and big stuff like this, really robust, really well made, good components. Chewing one, bus, distortion, and we have the smaller line of products, same components, same quality, really robust too, but they are simpler, they are smaller. And we have a whole line from overdrives to distortion, simple boosters, uh, and delay prototype coming through uh, by May or July. We have chorus, flanger, phaser, a lot of pedals. We have the, in our big line, we have things that come from a dual drive, it's a two channel overdrive, and they are actually different, so if you make the same settings, you have two different pedals. They both can go from overdrive to super overdrive or hyper overdrive, so you have a very wide range of drive effects here. Then we have a distortion, this orange guy here. It's an interesting pedal, you have three different settings here. Pedal sounds really different when you choose change here. And you have two distortion settings, so you have the extreme mode. You set extreme here, and then you're playing, and then you want more distortion, you hit the extreme, and that's really extreme. Uh, we also have this amp simulator. It simulates the traditional types of amplifiers, uh, conditions of, for recording, and it's also an overdrive pedal, so you have it clean, warm and hot, and the amount of drive here. And it's very interesting because you have an independent booster here, so it's a very complete chewing one pedal. Then you have some modulation effects, our analog dual chorus. This is something that Andy Timmons loves, and he's a great musician. Uh, his requirements are really high, so it's an honor to have this pedal used by any Timmons. You have two channels or chorus and then you can switch between them instantly here. Uh, any Timmons is also using this red guy here, buzz and distortion, come closer. We have distortion right here, three buttons for distortion and we have three buttons for fuzz. Fuzz has three different modes, number one, number two and number three. Number three comes with an, uh, a vintage Octavia like Jimi Hendrix used to have, uh, uh, the Octavia thing, and you can have both turned on at the same time, distortion and fuzz with the Octavia, very interesting. Uh, we have something unique here, the bass shaper. This pedal is a, the most complete solution for bass, I can remember. You have the complete preamp here, bass, mid, treble level, you have the shape function, you have also an overdrive, two buttons, level and drive. It can also be a super overdrive if you press this button. You also have the noise gate here, and you have independent booster here. You can use uh, the effect or the effect only or booster only or all at the same time, preamp, drive and booster. You can use with a headphone. You can study at home without bothering your neighbor. You have the common ground and ground lift and output effector clean to control your balanced output. So it's a very complete pedal. Uh, we have another modulation here. Phaser and flanger. Two pedals in one. You can have them both turned on at the same time. You have flanger controls here for knobs, phaser control here for knobs, two extra buttons for flanger. You have very wide control and well, this is an amazing pedal, people love it. Huge circuit, very complex inside. The Pathfinder, you have four channels to plug pedals, so you can have four loops, A, B, C, and D, and you can create your patches combining those loops as you wish. So you can have number one, A, number two, B, number three, can be them all on at the same time, or only loop A and loop D, so it's a very interesting pedal. To, to, to organize our set, you know? And now we have the more affordable small line. They are all here. We start with the booster on the left, here. The, the black booster is a simple boot, single button, simple booster, 12 decibels, really powerful booster without any distortion. Then we go easy drive and booster. 
you have low gain here so you can use it as a booster or a well behaved overdrive in these settings so this is a very light overdrive now here the hot drives are hot drive so this is more powerful fat sound big overdrive and after that we have the distortion which we call power distortion it's a really strong distortion and we have a high emphasis button here to make it more metal like so we have a as you see a wide range here from booster to easy drive to hot drive power distortion then two kinds of fuzz traditional fuzz that's a distortion and then at higher sets really fuzz so we call it fuzz torsion and we have the fuzz with the octavia that same vintage octavia that Jimi hendrix used to use like we had the fuzz and distortion big pedal we have it here too so guys thank you very much vintage and rare for stopping by and letting me show our products love to be with you guys thank you